Hello. In today's video, we are going to discuss about a particular issue that I faced in one of my recent Angular projects. I had been using Angular Perfect Scroll Bar in my recent project. To get started with the Angular Perfect Scroll Bar, you can simply install it using npm package manager inside your Angular application. And you can follow along the documentation to get it up and running in your Angular application. I already have an application running here where I'm using the Angular Perfect Scroll Bar. Here you can have a demo about this project. Now if you zoom into this project, you can see. There you go. Here is the Angular Perfect Scroll Bar in action. So pretty much good scroll bar that's available out there on the web. Now the issue that I'm going to talk here is like when you open this scroll bar or when you open this drop down you can see that we are able to see the scroll bar here. Now if you scroll it down and you leave it the drop down is suddenly collapses or it gets hidden. Now if you again click on this thing and you go in here and you scroll it up and you leave it it's, it again closes down. So this is the issue that we are going to discuss in this tutorial. The solution to this problem is that you need to stop the event from the scroll click event from propagating upwards. So you need to, you need to stop the propagation of this particular event. So let's see uh, if we can select the scroll bar with some like if you can see here this is the scroll bar which is causing the issue. So we need to add an event handler on click of this particular scroll. So let's add an event handler to this particular scroll bar. So on clicking the button I'm going to add a click event. Okay, so what we did is uh, we simply um, we simply attached and click event handler to that particular scroll element, and when uh, it gets into this callback scroll method function, we are stopping the propagation of that particular event. Now let's see if this thing really works. Now if you go here and if you open the drop down again, and now if you try to scroll this thing, it works perfectly fine. You scroll and you leave, it doesn't really collapse. You scroll and you leave, it doesn't really collapse. When you select an element, it closes down. That's how it should be. So that's all for this video. Thanks for watching.